Hi friends, let's learn about Mars. Mars is a cold desert. It's half size of Earth. Mars is sometimes called the red planet. It's red because of rusty iron in the ground. Like Earth, Mars has seasons, polar ice caps, volcanoes, crayons, and weather. It has very thin atmosphere. There are signs of accident floods on Mars. But now water mostly exists in icy dirt and thin clouds. On some mountain hills like there are evidence of liquid salty water in the ground. Scientists want to know if Mars have had living things in the past. They also know if Mars could support life on now or on in the future. Structure and Surface Mars is a terrestrial planet. It's small and rocky. Mars has thin atmosphere. Mars has active atmosphere but the surface on the planet is not active. Its volcanoes are dead. Time on Mars One day on Mars, 24.6 hours. It is just a little longer day on Earth. One year on Mars is 687 Earth days. It's almost twice as long as one year on Earth. Mars Neighbors Mars has two moons. Their name are Phobos and Demomus. Mars is the fourth planet from the Sun. That means Earth and Jupiter are Mars neighboring planets. Quick History Mars has been known since accident times because it can be seen without an advanced telescope. Sunier for the first time, they used a small wheeled robot to study the surface of Mars. This robotic explorer called a rover was named Sunier. It was about the size of a micro oven. However, it went to share lots of important new information with scientists. The rover explored an area of Mars near its landing site. It is called as the Aries Valleys. Scientists were interested in the area because it looked like the site of an accident flood. The rushing water of a flood would have pushed lots of rock and dirt into one place. This means the rover could study lots of different types of rocks without traveling so very Spirit and Opportunity after success of Sunier rover, NASA wanted to send more rovers to learn about Mars. So, in 2003, they sent two rovers to the red planet. The rovers were named Spirit and Opportunity. Together, they were the part of the Mars Explosion rover mission. Spirit and Opportunity were made as twins. They both carried a lot of same scientific instruments and each was about the same size of an golf cart. On earth where there is water, there is life. Spirit and opportunity were sent to Mars to find more clues about the history of water there and to see if the red planet could ever have supported life. To do this, scientists sent two rovers to different landing sites. The rovers landed on the opposite sides of the planet. Not to be outdone by its twins, Opportunity also took many color photos of Mayton landscape. It is found evidence of water too. Opportunity study layers of minerals in rocks near its landing site. Evidence is collected. Suggested that its landing site was once the shoreline of a salty sea. The rocks 
that spirit and opportunity study shows the scientists that long time ago water on mars may have looked a lot like water on earth mars once had lakes and rivers on the surface like earth it also had water below the ground as well the water vapor in its atmosphere curiosity curiosity is the largest robot to ever land on other planet it is the size of a small suv because curiosity is, has a bigger wheels than previous rovers this help to roll over the rocks and sand without getting stuck however even uh, one driving day it still travels about 660 feet curiosity landed in galgate the mountain has many layers of rock each layer is made of different materials minerals from different time periods these minerals could tell scientists about the history of water on mars the rovers used many scientific instruments to study the rocks on galgate the curiosity used to drill make hole in the rock that once was made the mud at the bottom of the lake one of its other instruments studied the power drilled from the rock the information helped the scientists learn that the gale getter had ingredients that had accident life would have needed to survive perseverance rovers on mars have collected evidence of water scientists think it might be possible that life extinct on mars long time ago if there were living things they were probably tiny teeny little organisms something like bacteria here on earth but did life actually ever get started on mars the mars 2020 mission hopes the answer that question the mission will send a rover very similar to curiosity to explore the rocks dirt and air on mars like curiosity the perseverance rover is size of a small suv the rover new rover has a different goal and different instruments it look directly for signs of the past life on mars the new rover will also experiment with a natural resource that would help in planning a human mission on mars the atmosphere of mars is more made of mostly of gas called carbon dioxide but living things including humans need oxygen to breathe if human were to go to mars they would have to bring lots of oxygen however there isn't much room on the spacecraft to carry liquid oxygen thank you